The next tool we're going to look at is the free transformation tool which is a third tool within the menu options in the tool sets presented in Flash and what I'm, we're going to do is we're going to look at the tool in a little bit detail and notice that I've left out and I've skipped the sub selection tool that's because we're going to, going to come back to this tool as it's used in conjunction with the pen tool so I'll come back to the sub selection tool in the later tutorials what I want you to do is select the rectangle tool I'm just going to draw out a small rectangle and using the free transformation tool I want you to click on that and what I'm going to do is double click on the actual object double clicking on the object will select both of its fill and its stroke in other words the fill which is a color the lighter shade of the gray the inside as well as the line or stroke and what we can do is you'll see a number of of um, handles that have appeared and what we can do is select these handles to actually extend or transform our shape like so notice that if we hold shift on the keyboard will constrain the objects proportions so it will increase or decrease the size using the width as well as the height constraining both proportions we can also if we select from one area just simply can stretch that area out and if we select from the top we can simply stretch that area out too we can also if we hover over from a corner we can actually rotate the object like so as well now one thing to note about the, tran the free transformation tool is any rotation we create it will rotate according to the centralization point of the object which is highlighted by this area here by the shown by this white dot like so now if we wanted to change or manipulate this with particular focus when creating animation what we can do is simply select the free transformation tool and drag the registration point or the centralization point to a corner for example now flash will rotate the object around this actual point so this becomes very useful when creating animation or if we wanted to resize an object according to that centralization point so that's one way of working with the free transformation tool